There are two kinds of folks who wander around in spooky mansions trying to solve the mystery of who brutally murdered their grandfather. The mystery gang, and relatives. I'm the kind who gets metal scars. Why are you showing me this? Every mystery's answer lies in the past, and that's just where I'm looking. The Guardians grow restless. I want answers. And thanks to this magical book of death and destruction, I've got friends on my side. And together we slay monsters. We make a pretty good team, you know? Right. Welcome back to Let's Play Eternal Darkness, Sanity's Requiem. In the last episode, we completed up Chapter 4 of the Tome of Eternal Darkness, which uh, featured a new character, um, uh, K uh, Karim, I believe his name was? Karim? Yeah. Uh, he was uh, in the desert anyway. He had a girlfriend. Uh, she cheated on him. Well, she wasn't really his girlfriend, but they had, uh, they were promised souls for each other and all that stuff, and, you know, he, she just went ahead and got another man and got killed, and... Then Karim also died, but he did not suffer from the curse of the Tome of Eternal Darkness, which is a first from these chapters here. I mean, like, uh, some some sort of pious Augustus did not do him in, like the others, other two, like Ellie and Anthony. So, uh, yeah, now we're back in the mansion. We're also back in this reading room, which, I mean, appears to be the only room in the freaking house where Alex can read. Seeing how, I mean, I was upstairs last time like and I when I read the chapter now I'm here suddenly so anyway I can we read this journal of M Roy Vaz Roy, Roy part one this is a page from Maximilian Roy Vaz journal it reads everything that brightened my life now engulfed me in darkness I fed on the light of truth yet starved on the shadows of lies I have learned through my lifetime but no less than a newborn baby man what a philosopher. So I guess we just gotta, like, walk back up now to the second floor again. I don't like that because I don't like walking through the spooky house. But hey, a man's gotta do what a man's gotta do. I'm sure there's a purpose for putting us here every time. Um, also, the, the it's bleeding, like, above the door. Never mind. Random places in the house are just starting to bleed now. It's uh, quite worrying. Oh. Is the phone ringing? Please tell me that's the police officer. Where's the phone? Is it here? Oh, hey. Hello? Um. This isn't really happening. I don't remember you. No, I'm sorry. Great! Was that my grandpa? My grandpappy? This house gets spookier every time. Gosh dang it. Every time I return from reading a chapter. So uh, I guess now that we uh, did the thing with uh, Karim last time, uh, we got a uh, rune of some kind. Yeah? One of these ones. We can probably use that on the uh, thing. That we couldn't pass last time. The perv is still here. My eyes are still up here, you jackass. Gosh dang it. So, uh, yeah. I am i don't think I'm ever going to get used to the whispering. I have to be honest with you there. But anyway. Now we can go over here. Uh, over there with the thing. I also wanted the wallpaper in the section. Of the, yeah. I don't think we can do much about that, though. Or at least not yet. Is this gonna spaz? Yeah, it's gonna spaz out. Can we just... No? Okay, we gotta do a thing. Okay. Um... Let's see here. Or maybe we can't do the thing. Maybe we don't have the right thing. What rune is it showing there? It was like a... Oh, we don't have that. Okay, so I guess what we gotta do is we gotta go downstairs to that room uh, with the... Uh, where the green door suddenly had appeared after a chapter... Two, I believe. Um, and insert our uh, dominance, our green dominance over that. Yeah, this one here. I think so. I think that's the thing we gotta do. So, um, yeah. How about that shit? So what's uh, what's up with my life lately? I uh, I went to a job interview for the first time in my life here the other day. Um, I didn't like it. 
it was uh, quite a nerve-wracking experience, gotta say. Gotta say. I don't think I did very good. They were like, oh, uh, we'll call you on Tuesday, uh, to, to Monday, Tuesday next week, maybe. And I'm like, okay. So, I mean, if I hear from them, then I do have the job. And it would be quite nice, because it... Alright. I think it's a job that I would want. But, uh... Yeah. Spice jar? Alright, the kitchen is as empty as the library is full. A reflection of her grandfather's attitude. Alright. Cool. What can we use this for? Uh... Arabian spices. Uh, oh, it's a piece of paper. Heck yeah, dude. Oh, it's a new chapter page. Sweet. All right. Um. Oh, hey, it's Sauron again. What you been doing, evil lord things? Yeah, evil overlord things. The light in the age of darkness has been extinguished. The pillar of flesh has been constructed. Yum. The master of chaos, the keeper of the ancients, is long dead. The planets will be in alignment soon. All is prepared for your Is this some Hercules shit? I will begin the final incantation. Bring you into our world within days. Damn. The next millennium will truly usher in a new age. Is that why they call them Your the Dark bodies. Ages? Now prepare the gate. Uh, w w what? No, don't just. Th Dude, spice is expensive. Don't just throw that shit away. Oh, hey, it actually glows. Sweet. Oh, hey, rat. Hey, dude. Okay, I'm not going to try to stab the rat. The, the whispering noise appeared just as I was about to stab the rat, so I'm going to assume that's a bad idea. I also don't quite understand, like, oh, the kitchen is over here, but, like, what? Is this place the kitchen? This is the creepiest kitchen I've ever been in. Probably a result of it being in a horror game, but never mind that. So, yeah, um, before I open the chapter page, or open, start reading the chapter page, one to a job interview kind of sucked. But, you know, it was an experience, so it's it's good to have on the uh, road ahead. So, you know, that's that's neat. I will not argue that I was shocked then. by the sudden mention of one of my ancestors, the distinguished Dr. Maximilian Roivas. Oh, I guess that's uh, M. Roivas. It chilled me to my bones. Where had this ancient book come from? How had my ancestor stumbled upon it? I feverishly began to read more. That's the best kind of reading. His story. It seems that Maximilian had inherited his father's mansion, just as I How had. old is this mansion? Alone since the death of his wife, and since his children had their own adult lives, he explored the house to discover his family roots. Sounds about a lot like what Alex is doing, to be honest. It was 1760. It's like 200 years ago. It has been two weeks. Are you impressed with my mathematics? And it has finally come to me to look over the mansion. Now I am truly alone and forced to start a new life here in Rhode You're not really ever alone here, are you, in this mansion? I intend to make the mansion mine and live in it as my forefathers have to continue the family tradition. You know, put in some new the doors or whatever, paint the walls sure. and all. My time here Ah, nothing like that old quill pen. Sweet, so we're, uh, we're a 1700s dude now. The Baroque and all that shit. Max has found some flintlock pistol ammunition. That's good. Oh, we're just gonna call him Max? Like, we know him? We're on friendly terms? How do you know I'm not, like, the enemy? The, how do I not know this is my mortal enemy? Max apparently is not a connoisseur of paintings, as Alex is, because he can't really examine jack shit of this. You say anything about this painting at least? I mean, look at it. It looks like somebody shat out a GBA texture. Okay, no, nothing. Not at all. This one? 
No pretentious words or anything like. I don't know. Uh, the 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 mansion uh, depicted above d uh, d d d d glows in a narcissistic manner that is very reminiscent of the early works of uh, Mozart, the composer, potionist. Nothing, not a one. Also, Moses is the composionist. You know. All right. So uh, I, this is the same mansion. This is interesting. Very interesting. This, uh, the, the ghost to show how old this wallpaper here is. I am quite impressed though, because it's been holding up very well. There's something odd about it. Perhaps the curious detail of its shapes and content. There's nothing weird about this. Am I hearing nice music in the background in this mansion? Is that possible? The door to the servants' quarters is securely locked. Maximilian, however, can't help but feel uneasy. An ominous presence lurks behind that door, making the hairs on his neck. Oh, no. My... Uh, se That's where the hole in the wallpaper is in the future. Cool. I'm going to guess this guy doesn't have a whole lot of stamina based on... Oh, nothing at all. What the f... That scared me. <laughs> Oh, that kind of, yeah, pre what duties? Yeah, I don't trust you, dude. Your room is, uh, has an evil presence or whatever. So, like, I know what you're up to. You're not getting paid this month. I'll just tell you that much. Is this your shitter? Polished teak and it is truly a sight to behold an experience. I think that's his shitter, yeah. That's where he poops. I feel bad for you, son. I got 99 problems, but the toilet ain't one. A. Hey. All right, let's see if a Pervamagu is here now. In the past, that's a sentence I didn't think I was going to say. Is here now in the past. Let's look at the bathroom, eh? I'm prepared this time. Come at me, bro. I'm ripped. Come at me, scrub lord. Come at me, uh, 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 jump scare lord. I ain't even scared this time. I'm gonna take a letter first, though. This might be imp this might be important. A letter written with some precision in long hand. Dear friend, the antiquity of which you ask is indeed the Tome of Eternal Darkness or a copy of it at least. Its secrets are still hidden from me, for I have been unable to read it, as have most scholars who have tried. It will remain within the sanctity of the mansion, for in the wrong hands it will be a powerful weapon. Peruse it if you will, but wear its magic. It is a harsh mistress. Aaron Roivas. Alright. Oh, hey. There's a lot of servants here. The servant mutters under his breath, not realizing that Max is nearby. He appears to be distressed at his lot in life, working all the time. Yeah, I get that. Regbormor. Re Rebgormor. Rebgormor? I'm gonna put all these together at the end of the game and just make a Swedish chef video, I think. It's a very nice painting. There's a disturbing amount of uh, scantily clad men with scantily clad babies. However, okay, I'm prepared for you this time, bathroom. Yeah, that's right, it's what I thought. Not so tough anymore, are you? Yeah, no jump scares or nothing. The mirror's grim reflection returns Max's questioning gaze, his face racked with sleepless nights and a strange gleam in his eye, hint at a growingly odd demeanor. Cool. When did, when did towels become a thing? A, 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 ting, a ting. When did towels become a thing? Like, when was that an invention? Because that, that's the thing I've been thinking about. Like, some inventions are very like, oh, obviously they've had this for hundreds of years. But then some inventions are like, damn, that is uh, surprisingly new, surprisingly recent, like the can opener or whatever. Like, un un unless I remember incorrectly, I believe the can opener came after the can. Like, the, the, the tin can. That's, that's interesting. There's a clock here in the future. I should just spoil everything for him. An open letter. Cool. I'm gonna go snoop around everybody's business like it's my own. Letter number two. Scrawled by a panicked hand with clotted ink. Dear friend, the house has been forsaken by the ancients. I dare not enter it for fear of my mortal soul. I would suggest that you leave also. Bring the book. It is a far more potent tool than you have learned, and may well swing the balance in our favor. Aaron Rivers. Or a, a Rivers. Doesn't necessarily have to be Aaron, but... I'm going to assume it is. Could be arsehole, Roivas. 
So many secrets we uncovered in the house. Oh, yes. Oh. Hey, we're back to the creepy music. Good. Now it feels like home. Now it truly feels like I belong here. There's a disturbing amount of stone tablets in this house. I would I would be worried. Let's see. Got any spices? A pump handle. Alright, that's gonna be useful, I am sure. Can we use it as a weapon? No? Okay, good. Uh, whilst going about her duties, the servant casually remarks about a strange quality hanging in the air. The odd comment makes Maximilian feel like something is quite amiss. Why would she say that? Because I farted. Ha 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 Classy. Now what is this? Flintlock? A lot of flintlock pistol ammunition here for... Not having a flintlock pistol. Surprisingly. Now I'm a little interested though. Are we gonna get to uh, solve that whole uh, cosmic looking room mystery thing? That I haven't been able to do anything about yet? There is something written beneath the image. When darkness spreads its wings before my master, Salatot's greatest foe, the passage of truth will find the bear. What? Perfect. Oh. Ow. That hurt. <laughs> greatest foe. I'm going to assume that it's red, because fire beats grass. Damn, son. Dude, I love secret passages. Um... Uh, don't don't crawl on the fire though. That's a bad idea. A curled scroll of aged parchment sits atop a stack of dusty books. Cool. Reveal invisible. Now that's interesting. That is uh, that is interesting. Medical journal. What? Oh, he's a doctor. All right. Cool. Um, let's see here. Where's the gosh darn? Invisible thing. Where's the ruins? Nothing? We can't? We can't do anything of- oh, right, we need the, uh, this one. The Tome of Eternal Darkness for that. Cool! Let's get it and ruin his life! Let's get a weapon first, though. This is a- I like these swords. They're very slender and nice, I would say. Show up to job interview in these, and then it's gonna be alright, because they know you're a badass if you have a saber. Especially if you spell it sabre. 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 Lying amidst the papers on the desk is a strange leather-bound book. Hmm. I do have to say, this is a way less conspicuous way to find the book compared to Anthony and Karim and Alia and all our other friends. Now then. Um. I like how the servant is j she doesn't give a shit. She doesn't even give a damn. She was just walking around there like, Oh, hey, there's a monster. Well, excuse me, uh, Mr. Monster. I have to clean the uh, table, so if you could please uh, lift your foot there. I believe you're standing on the table. Damn. Okay, let's read this letter and end the episode. A letter scrawled almost indecipherably by a wavering hand. Dear friend, as I suspect the ruins of Enga that blasted Necropolis lie deep under the site of this mansion. The accursed servants of Selatoth are so close I can almost hear the chittering. There's a secret opening in the basement, and from there we can gain access. I urge you to gather some men and seal it, or better still destroy that damn place. I have stowed something that you will find useful in the upper level. Look to the light and you will find it. I wish that I could be at your side, but my ailment worsens daily, and I know that my time is short. AR. You see, you know his time is short when you gotta shorten your name like that. It's when you know. Something tells me there's uh, a hint in here somewhere. But that's gonna have to wait for another time. It's just a game theory. Uh, uh, can I do uh, the, 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 uh, this one first though? Can I? Narakoth and Red Gormor runes. Do I have those? I do not. Okay, good. Well then, uh, next time on Let's Play it. Oh, sweet dude, it's a gun! Heck yeah, dude, I love ranged weapons. So next time on Let's Play Eternal... Uh, blindly play. Let's blindly play Eternal Darkness and his Requiem. Um, we'll probably go see how that servant over there is doing. In the lobby. With the beast. 
I'm sure she's fine. See you then. Goodbye.